this is a good stretch for your uh, forearm extensors so things like tennis elbow this this would really help what I'm going to do so I'm treating my I treat my right arm and maybe I'll see better what I do is I bring the shoulder height and I'll make sure my elbow stays locked throughout this whole thing and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll my fingers down knuckle at a time and then I'm going forward and then I'm going to once I get now I'm sort of bending towards the back of the hand to try and get the back of the hand against the wall and I'm feeling for a stretch across the top here keep my elbow nice and straight as soon as I start to feel a stretch here what I'll do is I'll stop I'll back off a bit so I'm just on the stretch and then what I'm going to do is you can't see it but what the action I'm doing is I'm pushing like that into the wall so I'm pushing through the hand into the wall at about a 30 to 40 percent effort and I'm going to do this for 10 to 12 seconds so let's say that's 10 11 12 I'll stop relax and I'll let lean in a little bit more and I should be able to go a little bit more and then I'll feel the stretch and then I'll ease off and then I'll rest here for 10 to 12 seconds after that time's elapsed I'll push again so I'm pushing with my hand into the wall 10 to 12 seconds that's 11 12 relax and then I'll go forward leading in feel the new stretch ease off so I'm always and I ease off and I'll rest so I'm always resting just just on the cusp on that stretch so I'm resting now for another 12 seconds after that 12 seconds I'll push again pushing my hand into the wall and when that time's done 12 seconds again relax go slightly more into it feel the stretch back off and now I'll hold it here 20 to 24 seconds and after that I'm going to come out and that's the end so you wait at the end 20 24 seconds to try and almost you must try and reset the muscle length yeah show the tell the body this is it's something called a gto but that's what you're resetting and that should really help conditions like tennis elbow things like that get these extensions stretched off but don't elicit pain just feel the stretch back off and then push okay if pushing hurts like all oh, that hurts don't do that put your other hand there and pull in pull your hand this way yeah and that won't hurt so you do exactly the same way but this time you're pulling in instead of pushing against the wall. That's if it hurts to push against the wall.